All right, got everything taken off the shelves, got all the accessories out, nothing left on the walls. I'm keeping that light up now. For right now, it's just gonna help me. But next thing we're gonna do is start taking apart some of these bath fixtures. So first thing I did with the toilet, go ahead and turn this valve. Sometimes you might have um, like a quarter turn valve like this one. This is an old quarter turn valve. I'm gonna replace that, but um, turn it off, flush the toilet, and then you'll see the tank. The water's almost gone. There's just like an inch at the bottom. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take a, a sponge and soak that up to get the rest of that out of there. And then you can even take like a, um, a shot back or something, trying to get the rest out of the inside of the toilet. A little gross, but um, then down here, I'm gonna turn these suckers off. I've already replaced these, so. If I can get them to work here. Okay, it's gonna be a two hand job here. So, um, and then I'm gonna go ahead, disconnect um, the drain, okay? And then I'm gonna take my utility knife, and I'm gonna score all this caulk, and I should be able to lift that vanity out. Same thing I'm gonna do at the bottom of the toilet. Go ahead and make a cut. You might even use like a putty knife too. Um, and then you'll also want to make sure that once this is off, you make that disconnect point right there. Sometimes you may have a valve that's so old that it actually doesn't shut the water off all the way, so you may have a little bit of a leak. So be prepared for that with some towels and a new valve so you can replace it. And then, uh, let's see, for the bathroom stuff, it's already off. You really don't have to worry about it. If you want to be super careful, you can shut off the whole house water, but if you're like us and we got our family continuing to use the house, uh, it's not easy just to leave the water off for several days. So I'm going to leave those. Um, you can take those off without having to turn the water off somewhere from a separate valve. So I'm going to go ahead and start taking these apart and I'll show you once we get to that point.